Hello ladies and gentlemen of the internet. I hope you guys are enjoying your day. Today is another beautiful day here in New York State. Today I'm trying to make a deal with the devil. Well, maybe not a deal with the devil, but this thing is hard as hell to get going. I did a little bit of talking with my buddy Tim. He has agreed to help me with this as long as I help him out with some other projects. Now that's a good deal. Both parties win. Saying that, before we get this thing on the trailer, I gotta unload my Honda. Well, I guess I don't have to, but it's one less bike that could fall over. Roads here in New York State suck. Your bikes start bouncing around, fall off the trailer, no good. So keep them off the trailer as much as you can. I have the GS1000 on the back of the truck, got the Honda off. The reason why you didn't see the Honda yesterday is because I kind of wanted to let the radar cool down after uh, the day before's event. This is private property, so I don't think the cops could do anything anyways, but uh, as soon as I get out of here, they could give me troubles. <laughs> oh, the cats. <laughs> I didn't want any more attention. How's that? Things, you know, there's a cop right there. So now what? So in my opinion, that all worked out. I'm gonna get this bike up to that shop. I don't know if we're going to work on the bike first or, the, or his machine first. I'd rather work on his machine. I'd rather give before I get. That was the last clip of the GS1000. Unfortunately, we had to say goodbye to the GS1000. As you can see, it's not here. The Honda is sitting exactly where the GS was. Unfortunately, we didn't make any progress at all. We invested like five hours of time. Cylinders three and four seem to be getting vacuum, where one and two are not. We're getting the same compression from cylinder one as cylinder four. I'm kind of confused and I'm kind of irritated because I have invested a lot of time and a lot of money into this thing. I had no intentions of this becoming such a big problem. I saw the engine going in the gator a long, long time ago and it just hasn't gotten there. And we've got to the point where it's so confusing. We have the same numbers on cylinder four and cylinder four is doing well where cylinder one and two are not. I just really want to get this engine going. You guys want to see this engine going. Because as soon as the engine's going, like I said, we can throw it in the gator. Once it's thrown in the gator, then we can put stacks on it. Then we can start ripping it. Then we can start painting it. Then we can start roll caging it. And the list can continue to grow. It just sucks when you don't really progress because it's like, how can you really film that? How can we really make a really long vlog today? As of right now, I don't know what the plan is for tomorrow. I do owe Tim some time because like I said, we invested like five hours into this thing. He was generous enough to not even focus on his stuff. We strictly focused on mine, and that's awesome. So I want to repay him tomorrow. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this short little 3D Machines quickie. I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day. I hope you stay froggy fresh, stay super fly. Until tomorrow, you can get your 3D Machines apparel in the description. 3D Machines out.